English phrasal verbs from everyday life from EspressoEnglish.net. Phrasal verbs are extremely common in English, and today I'll teach you 10 phrasal verbs based on my daily routine. First of all, my morning coffee makes me perk up. I'm not a morning person. A morning person is someone who has a lot of energy in the morning, so I need some coffee to help me perk up. The phrasal verb perk up describes when someone becomes happier and in a better mood with more energy after feeling not so good. After coffee, I look through my emails and dash off quick replies. I get a ton of emails from students. That means a very large number of emails. So one of the first things I do is look through my messages. To look through means to look at a number of things quickly. I also dash off replies to any messages that need quick responses. The phrasal verb dash off means to write and usually send something fast. Then I come up with new lessons. The main part of my work is coming up with new lessons. The phrasal verb come up with means to create or invent. I heat up some food for lunch. If I have leftover food, food that I prepared previously and saved, then I heat it up using the microwave, stove, or oven. To heat up food means to raise the temperature, to make it hot. After lunch, I flesh out my ideas. I have a lot of ideas for Espresso English, and I try to flesh them out. This phrasal verb means to add more details or more information to the basic outline of an idea or project. In the afternoon, I wrap up my work. The phrasal verb wrap up means to finish, to bring to a close. I could also use the phrasal verb finish up here. This is simply an informal way to say finish. I then make a trip to the supermarket. If something is on sale, I stock up on it. This means to buy a lot of a particular item in order to keep in reserve. In the evening, I do some exercise. Before starting to work out, work out means exercise, intensely, I warm up. This phrasal verb means to do a light version of the activity in order to prepare for more intense or more difficult activity. Afterwards, I make plans to meet up with my friends. This phrasal verb is an informal way to say, I encounter my friends. It's been a full day, so at night it's pretty easy for me to doze off. Doze off means fall asleep. I think the most natural way to learn phrasal verbs is in conversation, and that's why I created an entire course to help you do so. In the Phrasal Verbs in Conversation course, you'll learn 500 phrasal verbs that are used in everyday spoken English through dialogues that are easy to understand. Visit EspressoEnglish.net, click on Courses, and look for Phrasal Verbs in Conversation.